Come on. Hello guys. Today I'm going to make a pandisal, but I want to add cheese, so I call this one cheese disal. Ingredients: uh, one tsp of salt, one tsp of yeast, one tablespoon of sugar, and 50 grams of flour and then 70 ml of lukewarm water this is for the first dough first add salt sugar and then yeast Cover and set for 5 minutes for yeast fermentation. After 5 minutes, pour into the flour mixture. The mixture should be like this, watery. Cover and let the dough rest for one hour. Let's make a second dough. First, uh, 60 ml of milk 25 grams of melted butter one tablespoon of sugar one egg and then Yung first dun ang ginawa natin kanina. This is very sticky dough. And then, powder milk together with the flour. Very sticky. Start and read. I forgot always my scraper. No need to add flour. Need for about uh, 12 minutes until the dough becomes smooth sticky 
Okay. But no need to add flour. If you add flour, then your dough becomes very hard and then the result, the pendicel is not floppy. After 10 minutes of kneading, <sighs> keep away. Look at my dough, very smooth. Cover and let the dough rest for one hour. After one hour, Cut the dough into 10. Around 50 grams each. Yep. Cover and let the dough rest for 15 minutes. After 15 minutes, the dough is ready. Breadcrumb cheese. Cover and let the dough rest for another one hour. After one hour, the pandesal is ready. Bake at the preheated oven 180 degree for 12 minutes. Ready.
Oh, not that this one. It's, it's cheese this one. Turn. Come on. This is very hot. <laughs> Look at the cheese inside. Oh. I love it. Thank you for watching.